have 600 plus ideas. How do I start with the execution part? You start. It can seem extremely overwhelming if you've got 600 ideas. Start with one of them. I don't care which one. Obviously it would make sense to go with the best one, but it really doesn't even matter. What matters is that you start. You take it from an idea to an execution, and that takes work, that takes effort, and that takes you having the mindset to stop thinking, stop procrastinating, stop dwelling, and start doing. So just start. So many of the things that we've been doing lately, so many of the things that we're doing right now um, are working and are successful because of the fact that we didn't contemplate, we didn't think about it, we didn't dwell, we didn't you know, sit down and write a pros and cons list a mile long and figure out if it was a good idea or not. We just came up with an idea and executed. Came up with an idea, executed. And I think each person has to realize within themselves what degree in which they can go all the way, no net, or they need that little bit of safety to kind of start and then build upon that. For some people, they just need to cut bait 100% and then say today's the last day of this, the first day of that, and then go all in. That's some people's personality. Other people, they need to take time for, so when they get off work at five, get home, see the family, have dinner. But once seven, 7.30, 8 p.m. rolls around, you know, till midnight, it is just nonstop work. Uh, on the other business, the side hustle, or whatever that may be, and until that becomes big enough to start replacing chunks of income in the full-time career to where that transition is a little bit easier. Uh, this very vlog that you are watching right now is an example of an idea that came to fruition in a matter of a month. And I'm talking about an idea from no videographer, no idea what it would be like to have someone follow me around. No idea what the content would look like. No idea really how I could even pull off the fact um, that when I go into my meetings every day, they can't be recorded. Uh, but the fact that I do have a message to say and I do spend a lot of time on the road and I do uh, think it's important for people to hear. Uh, no idea what it would be called. No idea uh, what the common theme throughout every episode would be, but just knew that it was important to level up, if you will, on the level of content that I'm putting out. Regardless, there has to be this idea of where you want to be, you know, five years from now, 10 years from now. Um, if five years from now, 10 years from now, it's running that business that you're now doing on the side, then your actions on a daily basis need to match that. 